hi guys welcome back to my channel and today in this video I'm going to be telling you about the footprints of the Queen in Chandor these are the footprints of the Queen the myth of this curse still looms large over a part of the village that was once the site of ancient Chandrapur capital of Kadamba dynasty which ruled Conquered Goa by Vijayanagars its... in 1367 in order to circumvent the curse, many eligible youths from Chandor have migrated to urban towns like Margao or Panaji, fearing harm to their matrimonial prospects. A peek into history lends a perspective to the villagers' belief. History has it that on the midnight of October 16, 1345, Nawab Jamaluddin of Hunavar mounted a two pronged attack simultaneously. On Goapuri, present day Goa Velia, and Chandrapur, present day Chandor, in which the newly crowned king, young king Shri Siriya Veda, was slain, and along with him, all the male members of the Kadamba family were killed. His young queen was away at her father's palace at Hungal. Upon her arrival a few days later, she was aghast to know of her husband's death. Prior to her arrival, all the females of the royal court had ground their jewellery, tossed the powder in the river before jumping in, killing themselves, suspecting treachery. The distraught queen broke her bangles on the stone in front of the Santiago Chapel on Chandor, Kota, Kadamba Gate, and dusted her heels three, three or four times, cursed the woman of Chandrapur that all of them may suffer her plight. The curse was, every woman in the village would become a widow. The stone with a poor footprints is still preserved. The queen's curse made neighboring villages stop giving their daughters to the men of Chandrapur and its people fell on hard times. So thank you for watching my video and please do support, share and subscribe and please press the notification bell for you all to get notified for my upcoming videos. Thank you.